Mario C. was gunned down about 7.40 p.m. The victim was resting at the sofa located at the living room of their house when uh, one unidentified male person surreptitiously opened the main door, pulled a gun and uh, shot the Mario Maximo C., uh, which resulted to his death. I've known Mario C for quite a long time. He submitted some of his photos to us. In fact, the last time I refused to accept that photo, I told him it will uh, give some risk to your life. What's happening here in our country is they kill journalists in the far-flung provinces. And I don't think that's fair for us. Most of the time, it came from text messages. But I don't answer it. Every time I get the threats, I give it to the intelligence community and trace it and put it on record only. But nothing happens. Nothing happens. I cannot deny the fact that there is still that perception or belief that there is culture of impunity. But that is something that this administration is, is trying to, uh, to uh, end the culture of impunity. Thank you to both presidents. Uh, President Aquino, as a journalist, I'd like to ask you uh, why 26 journalists have been killed since you took office. And I understand that there have only been suspects arrested in six of those cases. What are you doing to fix that? With regards to the killing of journalists, Perhaps um, we should state from the outset, I don't have the figures right, uh, right here before me, but we did set up a, an interagency committee to look on extra-legal killings, enforced disappearances, torture, and other grave violations of right to life, liberty, and security of persons. And in this particular body, Do you imagine how many media killings has happened already here in our country and yet there are no masterminds yet in jail? Why?